It's a restaurant? Mm. Nice. Autonomy. What does triangle mean? Is it better? It's more expensive? That was a wrong move. That, that was a wrong move. Okay. It's whatever. It's whatever. Double circle is best. Majin. Don't look at me. <laughs> Listen, it, it, the, the Marigold Johnson at the restaurant was worse. Trust me. Fuck. I save over the wrong thing? That's 11.39. Okay, alright, we're good. Jesus Christ. You understand how the real estate works? Sort of. You're not assigning them to it. But if I invest, don't I get more money? Or I make the restaurant more valuable? So now I'll get more payout later? Cut it out! Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Shut the fuck up, bitch! Like I said before, I want to see that... Karu man, or whatever his name is. Hurry it up! Like I already told you, he's not here right now. Hey! I'm right here, motherfucker. What you want? Yeah, I can do you can do that, which is a smart move. Hmm. Mr. President! Oh, you're the president! Wait, oh, you're the leisure king, bitch. Okay. You! I bumped you I bumped into you on the street before, right? You're President Kido, huh? And you're the Leisure King, so what do you want? I got better things to do than reminisce with you. Hey now, you come into my turf and mess with my business, and that's all you have to say for yourself? Where are your manners, man? I don't see what your problem is. I'm running a legit business here. Yeah, come on, bro. It's, le le it's legit business. Don't you get it? I'm telling you that is my problem. So what's this about? <laughs> Beating around the bushes in my style. If you get in my way, you get a little visit from me and the boys. You remember what happened to Yamano, right? Yamano, right? You're rotten to the core. I can't let you keep your stranglehold over this area. <laughs> I'll shut your pie hole right up so you can't give me a lip like that. Hey, what the fuck is that name? Hey, Texture. <laughs> why do you? Why don't you educate this idiot president? Yes, sir! Don't blame me if you end up dead, asshole. Okay. Okay, you, want, you guys wanna play this? Okay. I swear to God, I will fucking... Bro. What is this, Tekken? Motherfucker? I hate you, bro. Leave me alone! Bitch! Fuck you! Jesus. Wait, I actually lost? What do you mean? What? <laughs> Take shit, I don't, didn't stand a chance, huh? Not bad, not bad. Looks like you can walk the walk. You know what? I think I'll let you off the hook for today. But if you piss me off again, you're dead meat. I'll take you out myself, and don't you forget it. And if you die, all your properties will become mine. I'm perfectly fine managing things that way. If you don't want to die, get out. If you don't get out, I'll kill you. Simple, right? Think about it. Don't screw with the five billionaires, bitch. Mr. President, you alright? Uh. Yeah, I'm fine. Hit my face cam for nothing. Uh. 
Okay. Sub stories. Here we fucking go. So I need to get to the other side of the city. Is there a restaurant nearby? Um Maybe. Yeah, I'm not giving you that fish. Sorry. Oh, I dropped some frames? Hello. Can we not? Hopefully we can uh, knock through these sub-stories. Hopefully. As long as there's no more like... Back to back, you know what I mean? Like racing or dancing. I was okay with the dancing. There was a little bit too much uh, racing though. Is a cabaret thing in this game as well? Or was are y'all or were y'all talking about Kiwami? I hope y'all were talking about Kiwami. I don't think you guys were though. What was happening? Sub story time. Again. Oh, what's up, bitch? You were talking about Kiwami. What happened? Uh, the cabaret sub stories that Kitty was talking about. Is that this game or Kiwami? Okay, this is it. This game? Fuck. <laughs> Alright, it's fine. Really? A fortune teller who's never wrong? Mm -hmm. Really? They say she can actually see the future. That's why she's like, totally accurate. You know? You're serious? Like, if that's true, I wouldn't mind like, getting a reading. Like, where's this fortune teller? Is she? They say she moves around, but I heard like, she was last seen in the champion district. Apparently she charges a million yen for a reading though. How much? Like a million yen? I don't have that kind of money. Like, get real, bro. That just makes it sound totally bogus. But there must be people willing to pay the price. Like, I heard that to find her, you have to look for, like, her weird glowing crystal ball. Wow, I can't believe people would actually pay that. Maybe I'll just snoop around the champion district a bit. This is number one? Damn. Only this game. Hmm... Uh, champion district. Is it? Is it this? No. Champion district. Hotel district. This is it, isn't it? Yep. Ah! You there, hold on. Hmm? Sorry, fortune telling doesn't interest me. Try something else. Try someone else. I don't especially care to do your reading. I need some protection for myself. Hmm? Protection? What do you mean? You don't seem to be in any danger. I will be. Trouble's coming. 
My reading said as much. I'm gonna be attacked and soon. Daddy. Attacked? Indeed. A customer I read blames me for his woes and means to exact revenge. It's clear as day in my crystal ball. That's fucking ridiculous. Fortune telling isn't real. You would be right more often than not. But I'm a fortune teller who can see the future. I'm never wrong. Come now, look alive. My assailant is on his way. Don't worry, he'll, you will be rewarded for protecting me. Oi. You lying hag. I found you at last. See? Right on time. Uh. Guess you were right. I paid a million fucking yen and all you spouted was crazy bullshit that never happened. My girl lapped up your bullshit like it was gospel truth. She dumped me because of you. <laughs> All I did was tell her what I saw, you homeless and scourging in the trash for half-eaten food. Uh. Are you fucking nuts? I've been buying up buildings like crazy. No way the money's going to run dry. Pick through garbage, me? No one gets away with throwing dirt in my face. I'll teach you a lesson you won't forget. This is where you come in. You said there's a reward? Indeed, of course. <laughs> hey, stop that. <laughs> You're trying to beat up an old woman? No wonder your girl left you. Uh. Damn! Who the hell are you, her bodyguard? I'll just have to beat your ass first. That was a good one. Good job, Kita. Oh. There goes that. Damn it! Get lost. Got egg rolls? A. Eh, eh, eh. Thanks for that. I didn't expect you'd be able to predict that. Eh, eh, eh. Didn't I tell you? I'm a fortune teller who can see the future. Now do you believe? Nope. I don't believe in that sort of thing. Can you stop laughing? Such a close-minded man. No matter. I'll read your fortune as my thanks for saving Daddy. me. Read my fortune? Indeed. It would usually set you back a million yen. But for just this once, I'll forgo my fee. You should be grateful. Mm. Sounds interesting. I'll give you for I'll give your fortune telling a try. <laughs> it will be fun reading your fortune. I can tell already. Let's begin. First, your hands. Let me see. Nani, you're not using your crystal ball. Shh. Hurry while the stars are aligned. Uh. Okay. <laughs> Let's see now. Yo, uh, Switch, I don't know if you ever had a Jack in the Box Air Rolls. Uh, they, they're, they're fire. <laughs> they're fucking expensive, though. I thought so. Such lovely hands. The sort of strong hands I want wrapped around me. Oi. Whoa, 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 lady. Does this have anything to do with my fortune? <sighs> Shh. I have a thing for hands. I'm doing your reading for free, so the least you can do is let me indulge. I don't exactly have time to burn, lady. Would you mind going to the reading? <laughs> Getting to the reading. Fine, fine. So impatient. So, tell me. Which thread of your fate shall I unravel? Hmm. I have not. Jack in a box? Yep. Future. I hope I can get three readings. I probably fucked up. Ten years, you say. So, <laughs> I see it, I see it, shouldering blame for another sin, <laughs> a heavy burden to bear, and in the end, the millennium. I saw it, but you were behind bars most of the time. Oh wait, I thought Chad was going to pick, my bad. Hey, we picked the right one. So, we picked the one that you wanted. So, it's unavoidable. You're oddly calm about that. It doesn't come as any great surprise. By the way, you're locked up 15 years from now, too. Daddy. Still? That's a pretty long stretch. What did I get to do that? <laughs> if I were to spoil all, there is no to tell. The fuck did I just say? Your life would be a, dr a drudgery. That... Who the fuck says that? But I'll grant you a hint in the form of a little quiz. Your closest friend is in peril. You and you alone can take their place and accept their fate as your own. What do you think you would do? 
Only one who can take the place of a friend in trouble. Hmm. Try to solve it with money. That's the obvious answer, right? I'm the only one who can save them? Of course I'll do whatever it takes, even if it's taking the fall for them. I suppose you would. You wouldn't be able to stop yourself from helping your friend. Does that have something to do with me ending up behind bars? That you will find out for yourself. But I'm relieved. If you hadn't chosen your if you hadn't chosen your friend, all this could be for none. All for not? What the fuck are you on about? Didn't you say you don't believe in fortune telling? Eh. Nishki. Well now we dwelt on that matter enough. Oh, we can pick every- Oh, nice, nice. Hell yeah. Gotta save the homie. Hell yeah. Okay, how about telling me about my family? <laughs> eh, eh, eh. Very well, let's look at your family. I see, I see. Her real father. Ah, to atone for what you have done. Wrestling a viper in Okinawa. I have seen it. When it comes to you and your family, the picture is complicated. Okay, so tell me about it. This I can tell you. A child is with you. Daddy. A child? I have a kid with me? Indeed you do. The child trusts you above all others. Is it my kid? Boy. Hey! Don't clam up! Shh! I told you. It's complicated. You could claim it as your own, and would be justified in doing so. If you said the child was not yours, this too would be correct. That is complicated. Eh, eh, eh. It gnaws at you, does it? A hint then. I'll grant you a hint in the form of a short quiz. You have a child, one you love. If you had to, what price would you put on that child? Remember kids, don't be like Manja and lead the guards to your friend's location. Slander. There's no way I could put a price on anyone, kid or otherwise. <laughs> So very true! A person's value is not measured in money. But, you disappoint me. Huh? Putting a price on people is wrong. Even a fool knows that. So why bother getting so high and mighty about it? So disappointing you. Uh, sorry? I have you know this. You're gonna raise eight kids. Daddy. Eight? That's a huge fucking family. Is this some kind of joke? What can I say? You'll be like a dragon among daddies. Okay. Oi. What the fuck is that supposed to mean? You're just messing with me, aren't you? <laughs> I only told you what I saw. You'll see too. Mark my words. My, look how hot under the collar you are. Didn't you say you don't believe in fortune telling? Tell me about my career. <laughs> Oh, 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 there is turmoil. Ah, is that, is that the city of Fukuok? I, ah, fuck, I know how to... I've heard people say the city before, but I forgot how to say it. Fuck, I'm skipping it. Someone running out of a concert? Ah, I saw you driving a car. Oh, you're not surprised by that? Then let me ask you, what do you think you would do for a living? Um. Well, you said drive, so, you know. Uber? <laughs> you're not telling me I'm gonna end up as a cab driver, are you? You have to be joking. Very good, bingo, a taxi driver you are. Daddy. Bingo, and a taxi driver? Probably in the future I saw you wearing a low hat and a car with a, light, with a lighter display that said occupied on it. You're just making things up as you go, aren't you? I just can't imagine a future where I end up driving a cab. Refute it all you like, but I know what I saw. A splendid driver you were, I might add. So skillful, you even use your turn signal. I don't know what to think anymore. Oh, you don't believe in fortune telling anyway, right? blowing smoke up someone's ass. Tired, are you? All I did was tell you what I saw. Don't think ill of me. <laughs> Doesn't bother me. I don't believe in fortune telling after all. 
Even if I did, you can't expect me to believe I'll be a cab driver in Fukuoka and living with a gang of kids in Okinawa. I figured it out how to say it. <laughs> no, I suppose not. You can't believe. You can't believe or not. That choice is yours, at least. Well, that was interesting. Take care. I'll give you one parting gift. One more vision. A young man will speak to you. Your fate and his will be untangled. Blowing smoke again, huh? I told you, I don't believe in fortune telling. Defiant to the end, but perhaps that was, that was what makes you a legend. Just about nonsense. Farewell someday. You'll know just how right I was. I'll see about that. Whoa, yo, pal, watch when you're stepping! Yeah. Uh, yeah, sorry. Guess school trips ain't bad once in a while. So, this is Kamarocho, huh? All this grit and glitter, what a town. Mmm. Mm. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, he came all the way over here from Majima City. All right, all right. I fucks with that. I'm gonna go save right quick. Uh, there it is. Zero Dragon. The next up story should be in here. Should be. Get out of the way. Face cam? It's gonna be a lot of talking, fam. I don't know about all that. <laughs> We're keeping it off. We're keeping it off. Oi. Hey, you you good? <laughs> I not feel good. Please. You want me to get... Whatever, whatever, whatever. Fine. It's not like this costs fucking 7,000 fucking yen. Oh, I feel much better. Thank you. What happened to you? It happened a little while ago. I lose my job. Your job? Yeah, my job. My job for money. Oh, you mean your job. It's job, not yob. My... Job. I work for sex. I work the sexy job, but I no take it no more. I run away from sexy job. But owner, he catch me and he roughed you up. He take my passport. I have no passport now. If the immigration find me now, I get kicked out of Japan. Then I know can send money to family back home. Passport? I assume you mean passport. Yeah, passport. Some Japanese easy to say, some not. I practice, but this the hard speak. I need visa. Visa? Yeah, visa. I have the visa. I work good. I'd be happy. I'm not sure what you mean by visa. I have no. I no have the visa. Without the visa, I in trouble. Need the visa, but no one can get the visa. <laughs> God damn, bro. It's so bad. Fucking take a shot every time you say Biza, dude. Does she mean pizza? Hey, remember when Fable made fun of me for for how I said pizza? Suck my ass. What? Yeah, I guess I can see how that would make you happy. Yes, everyone happy with the Biza. I want to be happy too. I get the visa. I work job, no visa, no job. Family, no eat. She's talking about visa, right? It's not pizza. You know where I get the visa? Do I know where to get it? Sure, I think so. Ooh, really, you know? Where? Don't they sell them around here? I heard they even started to deliver them right to your house. 
That true? This country's so ad advanced. I want to ask you a sis. You give me the visa? Nani? Me? Need the visa. Visa costs money. I got no money. No money, no visa. I think you get it the other way. Please? You get the visa for me? Mm. Bro. Whoever is taking shots right now, you're dead. You ain't making it tomorrow. Holy fuck. <laughs> Easy for you to say. I was hurt and fall and nobody come. You only won. In all of Japan, you're only nice, man. No one else. You only one I can ask, please. You give me the visa. Okay, I see what I can do. Ooh, you do it for me? Thank you very much. Then I work. Then I be happy. I had visa once. Now my visa time gone. No more left. Well, I guess you do have to get through it before it goes bad. Sorry, I got no money for visa. You take this, please. Secret wallet. I don't have money. I mean, space. Oh my god. Oh, um. What is trash here? To be honest. Okay, I got this. I'll be back with a hot and fresh one. Yes, I'm so happy. My name, Samantha Thomas. Blet, please get me. Uh, uh sure, I'm Kido. You can count on me. Kido Yusan, thank you. Did, did, did Kido just said a burger place is gonna sell pizza? What? Kido, please. Oh, Kido, please. Please. Oh, hello. Bro, stop hitting me. So, burger place. Aha. Okay. All right, no Valheim today, I guess. Spot us a little cash. What? Uh... Bro, who's talking right now? That subtitle is hella big, which is like something important. What? Whatever, man. We'll get to it eventually. Ask for a pizza at a burger spot. I take a pizza to go, the most popular one. Uh, did you say pizza? This is a burger shop, Daddy. bro. You don't have pizza then? I thought you have all sorts of Western food. I'm sorry, you might have better luck looking for pizza in the pizzeria. Mm. Pizzeria, huh? Is there one in Camarocho? Well, you could try pizza la. Pizza la. Hi. You order over the phone, they deliver it right away. It's very convenient. Incredible. Can you call this pizza la person and ask if they can give me a pizza? 
You know what the funny thing is? I had pizza today. Pizza Lot's the name of the pizza place, not a person. I guess it doesn't matter. I can call them for you. How about a special combination pizza? A large one's three three K N. Here's the money. Alright, I'll call Pizza Lot now. Thanks for waiting. Here's your pizza law order. All I had to do was make a phone call and they deliver? Wow, times sure have changed. Hi. Please enjoy your pizza while it's fresh and steaming hot. Some food is better cold, but certainly not pizza. Some would argue with that. You got a special combination pizza. Got it. Thanks. I appreciate it. No, no, no. Never a problem. Please enjoy it while it's hot. Next time, please also try one of our famous hamburgers. Uh. Sure. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> There's no way, bro. This is the fastest minute of my life. Don't get in the way, you motherfucker! I like them titties. Excuse me? I don't know. Lol. Ah, here we go. Hey, Samantha. Kill you, son. I got what you asked for. Oh, you did? <laughs> it wasn't easy. After all, it's worthless if it's not fresh and hot. Thank you very much. It's no good if it expires. Huh? Did you just say the P sound right? Hi. Yes, for job, I've been practicing. Now I can pronounce Japanese P and V sound. The real question is, are you good? I see, good job, Samantha. Thank you so much, so... Oh, right, yeah. I wasn't sure what you like, so I ordered something safe. It looked really good in the picture. Oh, picture? You need my picture? Huh? You have a picture of what you wanted? Sorry, I hope I got it kind of close. Oh, if it's close, it should be good. Kidding you, son. Are you, you are really nice Japanese. This first time a Japanese man is so nice to me. <laughs> Good to hear. Kidding you, son. I work hard. Work and work till you... Work and work till what you give me today expire. <laughs> till it expires? Well, it'll probably go bad pretty fast. <laughs> expire fast? Why? What you mean? <laughs> well, how long could it possibly last? A day, maybe? <laughs> a day? Oh, no, Kidding you, son. This is not good. Don't get me wrong, I'm no I'm no expert like you are, but then again, it might be different here in Japan than your country, Samantha. Oh, I see. Maybe Japan different. Alright, take this and good luck with your job. Kira, you son! Nah, you don't have to share it. It's all yours. Enjoy. Mm -hmm. This pizza! I need visa! Huh? Mm. But Samantha, you said you wanted pizza. So you could eat your fill and get back to work. No, that's not really what I say. How I work with pizza, dummy. <sighs> Yo, Samantha. It's time. Mm. Who's this? This man, he make me do sexy work. I run away. Daddy. Samantha, don't forget. You made me a promise. If you get a visa by the deadline, you get your passport back, and then you can leave this job. But, if you don't, you promise to work for me for the rest of your life. Uh, will you take this? Hmm? 
This is a pizza, not a visa. There's no one on the planet who would make that stupid a mistake. Come on, Samantha. Move your ass. We'll get you back to work and raking in the dough again. Hold it. What do you want? Sounds like your gig is working foreign girls illegally. And how does this concern you? Well, I feel like kind of responsible for this mix-up, so I want to let you... I want you to let Samantha go. What? Wait, are you and Samantha... You better not be touching my merchandise. Nah, there's nothing going on here. There was just a little mistake, that's all. You calling my girl a mistake? I'm gonna kick that piece of soap bar up your ass. You'll taste the pepperoni. Damn, that was a good one. Oh my god, you would fucking run. Bro, I swear to god, I can't use anything else but a rush. I say that. Alright, I'm getting real fucking sick of you. more hard to miss or shake now. I don't understand. Okay. That's it. I'm getting real fucking tired of you, man. Jesus Christ. Shit, this guy's for real. Samantha, you done taking orders from him? That wasn't a question. If you want a visa, apply properly like you're supposed to. I'll teach you how, alright? Here you sign. Hey. hey, Samantha's passport. Give it back to her. I can't. I... Samantha! Don't leave me. I have to tell you. Really, I... I love you! Yeah. What? I'm so crazy about you, I took your passport so you couldn't leave the parlor. I couldn't stand the thought of you going away. So this guy's a simp, huh? We getting banned, boys. I'm so sorry for everything, just... Just don't leave me. If you have it in your heart to forgive me. Please marry me. God d Bro, Jesus. We escalating out here. Marry? If you marry me, you can work in Japan without a visa. You can even keep wiring money to your family back home. But I don't want to do more sexy work. Of course not. I wouldn't force my wife to sell her body. Samantha, believe me, I'll find you legit work. I'm begging you, please, forgive me. And be by my side. Please, Samantha. Sheesh, bro. <laughs> what do you want to do, Samantha? This man, he did bad things to me, but... He only one who... He only one who take in woman like me and give me job. When I'm feeling lonely, he talks to me. Samantha... Back home, my family's still waiting, still hungry. I have to work in, J in Japan, so... I will marry him, Kita Yusan. You think it's okay? That's for you to decide. If you think it's for the best, I certainly won't object. Thank you, Kita Yusan. You. If you even look at Samantha wrong again, I'll make you regret it. You better make her happy, bitch. Or else. Yes, sir! Kita Yusan, thank you very, very much. This my thanks. Security wallet. Uh. Oh, we all eat at Kiryu's. We all eat Kiryu-san's pizza together. You sure? Of course. Let's eat it while it's still fresh. <laughs> Good pieces like a new marriage. Enjoy it while it's hot. Okay. Okay, we eat. Uh. Let's have some. Mm. What the fuck? Kidu, calm the hell down, bro. Did he just like force it down his throat? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> at least at the end of the day, the dumb mistake I made tastes better than a visa, right? Mm. Yes, Kidu, your son. Your visa is number one in the world. 
Are you stalking me, bro? What the fuck? Alright. That was good. Now we're getting into more, uh... Serious sub-stories, I guess. I'm not sure. Uh, we're going to the... Pink Alley. Fuck, where is that, man? I, I still don't know this fucking map. Go back to Pink Alley? Oh, this? Did he even fucking chew? I have no idea, dude. I think he just gulped that shit. How's my health looking? Human trafficking. Show letter of introduction. Fine, come. Well, we know how fucking Kido eats his pizza now. It's like fucking Goku, bro. So we're going back at the bar? Well, damn, I just fucking pushed that guy. So, in your opinion, Switch, which dance segment was the hardest? Kido's or Majima's? I'm not worried about Majima's because I haven't done it before. Mm. Should be the opposite, to be honest. You meet someone here? No, not really. You know the guy who always sits there? I was just wondering if he was coming by today. Ah, him. He used to come by pretty much every day, but I haven't seen him at all recently. That's odd. Last time I saw him was when you two were drinking together, I think. Ah, I remember. Makes you worry, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. I'm sure it'll be okay. Hope so. Please teleport me. Or not. It's so awkward seeing the subtitles now. Yeah, I like turn that on by accident. Ooh. Okay, now you're on the ground. This has to be more dialogue. Kasuga? Oi. Hitakun? What happened to you? Kitakun. Run! What? Come on, let's get you out of here. Little weasel. Look how far he ran. Who are you? Hand over that rodent reporter. Yeah. Sorry, I can't do that. He's an associate of mine. Oh, you're his friend, are you? Then you should know. 
This town's dark secrets are best left in the shadows. What a zoom in through the fucking ear, cameraman. Holy shit. I don't know or care who you clowns are. I just know your boy, your boy that came around sniffing this out. For that, you're both going on the auction block. Damn. All right. He didn't even lay a finger on me. What do you mean? You're not half bad, but not good enough. Too bad for you, the cavalry's coming. Let's see how long you can hold out against my backup with the rat to babysit. What is going on here? That voice. Boss man? What? Why would you come here by yourself, boss? I'm so sorry, sir. I'll take care of these two right away. Please. I beg your pardon. You may release them. They are free to go. But these... These fucking weasels came looking for a fight. They're ordinary citizens, nothing more. Just a little overly curious, I'm sure. But they know everything. And what of it? You're as much to blame for trying to conduct business with the civilian. Some secrets are best left in the shadows. I'm sorry, sir. I let him go. You got off easy this time. Hmm. We're safe? Save me again, Kitakun. Thanks. If it weren't for you, I'd be merchandise at the human trafficking room. You better take that lesson to heart, Kasuga. If you sniff around when you smell trouble, it'll bite you on the nose. <sighs> yeah, I know. You hauled me out of some deep shit twice now. Seriously, Kitakun, I'm sorry. Must have been over my head after all. I'll stop sticking my nose into Kamarocho's shadows for the time being. Yeah, cool your heels a while, man. And if you still want to chase the city shadows after the heat's died down, be more careful next time. <laughs> That's a sound idea, Kitakun. Maybe I'll lay low. <laughs> can laugh now, but if that man hadn't show up, we could have been in a world of pain. Uh-huh. Not that I know. I was out cold, but you saw the boss of the human trafficking ring, yeah? I envy you, man. I caught a glimpse, but he hid his identity under a hat. Even if I did see him again, I wouldn't recognize his face. That's still a massive cope. Coop. Cope? Cunts. We're talking about a guy who might control part of Kamarocha's underworld. Someone big. <laughs> Dream on. But the boss's voice and stature. I can't shake the feeling I might know him from somewhere. Mystery Mouse and Trafficking Terror. Is the ring's ringleader right up behind you? How's that for a headline? What did I say about cooling your heels? So much for learning your lesson. <laughs> Man, I'm sorry. Call it an occupational hazard. <laughs> Guess that's just who you are, Kasuga. <laughs> it's nice to see you two drinking together again. <laughs> yeah, that's true. See, Kasuga, our barkeep was worried about you too. Uh -huh. Oh, is that right? Thanks, you're the best, I swear. You got me as a daily regular for life. Very happy to hear that, but if I may, you must be more cautious around these parts after Are you the fucking human trafficking dude? Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Something the matter, sir? Yeah. Nah, it's nothing. Hey, that's pretty- I like this sub story, okay? I like twists like that. That was good. When it like, when the camera panned to his face, I was like, this motherfucker got the same facial hair, dude. Um, the tax lady. What the fuck? Uh, Electronics King? Hold on, what? I might have to go back to... Uh, I would, but... We'll save that for off the stream. Um, I wanna go to... I guess I'm going back to the... The real estate building. Oh. <laughs> 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 
Fuck's sakes. <laughs> Alright, we got him on a business, huh? Let's go. Nice. I don't think that dialogue matters, to be honest. Can I buy that building back? 